but let's start with our outright favorite. So I'm guessing from what you've said, this is gonna be someone from the right hand side of your list. Someone that has played here before. I have my guy, but I'm gonna let you go first. Well, I talked about Abraham Answer, who's got some RPMs under the hood. And of course, Colin Morikawa, who just won in Dubai and won the Open Championship and won the money list in Europe. He has been under the most pressure recently. Yeah. But my pick this week is going to be JT, Justin Thomas. He's got a new caddy. I think JT is motivated. Um, Diane, he's been, I, I watch him on uh, Instagram. He's, he's working on his swing. His dad was out most of the season with, with some health problems. So he, he wasn't highly coached working on his wedge swing. He drives it great. He's played good at this event. And I think JT has got a lot, a lot left in the tank. I think he wants to win the FedEx Cup. And this, by the way, has nothing to do with the FedEx Cup. I just think he knows this course really well. He's finished, I think, fifth and third. So a win here is a natural sort of progression for JT. And he's playing good. We saw him finish, uh, finish solo third at Mayakoba. So JT, it's all coming together. A new caddy with bones on the bag as well. Um, so yeah, I get that. However, uh, he's not my outright favorite. And my outright favorite is the outright favorite this week. And you mentioned him and it's Colin Morikawa. And how, how, can, how can he not be? I mean, just coming off winning the race to Dubai, we talked about Rory's collapse in the final round on the shirt rip. So Morikawa winning there, then winning the European Tour's season long money list. And when I think of this, this is Tiger's tournament. And if you're gonna look at one guy over the past, like what, five, 10 years, he hasn't even been playing for that long, but in the short time that he's been on tour, if you're gonna look at any young guy to really draw comparisons when it comes to Tiger, you're gonna look at Colin Morikawa. With the, his elite iron play, I just think that he, there's a reason why he's at the top of majority of people's boards this week. And then, you know, he's the open champion. So how can you ever see past that, especially when there's a few little comparisons to Lynx Golf at Albany Golf Club. So Colin Morikawa, no surprises, he's my number one guy this week. Well, he could have been mine, but I'm gonna let you have him this week because you got you got the pick first. But um, <laughs> we saw him win the Open Championship, of course, uh, with a three wood, which was kind of refreshing to see. We didn't, all these guys are going down that track, 220 mile an hour ball speed. Bryson was in the long drive contest. All these guys are show them, they get on Twitter and they show us how much ball speed they got. And here's Colin Morikawa sitting back here at 165 miles an hour. Those fairways behind you that are windy and hard to hit, they'll be the widest for Colin Morikawa because he's the best driver. So he'll be in those fairways all week. So of course, it's a good pick you know it's he has the energy he's young his yeah. hobby is like eating and he weighs like nothing so how is that fair it's a nice hobby to have